Dear viewers, today I am going to talk about nitrite toxicity in fish which is called brown blood disease. Fish discharge ammonia into water which is converted to nitrite using ammonia oxidizing bacteria. Then nitrite is converted to nitrate using nitrite oxidizing bacteria. However, nitrite oxidizing bacteria take longer time to grow than ammonia oxidizing bacteria. Thus, if ammonia availability is high, nitrite concentration increase, which is called nitrite spike. When fish are exposed to the high concentration of nitrite, nitrite enters into fish blood, also transmits chloride through gill. After entering into blood, nitrite and chloride oxidize ferrous state of hemoglobin to ferric state of hemoglobin. This is called methemoglobin. This methemoglobin has low capability of binding oxygen. Thus fish blood has low level of oxygen and blood becomes brown in color and this condition is called brown blood disease also called methemoglobinemia the clinical signs of brown blood disease are brown blood fish become lethargic and gill is damaged and muddy gill and also mucus production into the gill and skin and fish may die eventually if it is untreated. Now how can we control the brown blood disease in fish? We have to reduce the feeding rate, we have to reduce the protein content in the feed, we have to exchange the water if the nitrate level is more than 2 pm, 2 ppm and if needed we need to add sodium chloride or salt uh, the dose is 1 gram per liter which is 1 ppt we need to seek professional advices if required and thank you for watching